Hey guys, and welcome to Crow's Updates and News on Promo Locat and um, Crow the Sykes. <laughs> and um, I'm going to say, begin off saying that uh, I'm sorry that I didn't post a video uh, this week. Um, I'll, but before that, uh, this is basically my news and updates. I'd mostly make it like if I was just talking to you guys like, like friends. Even though all my videos are like that, but the majority I just stay in that topic. But for this one, I just jump around from things to things and let you guys know how I'm doing, how are things going, etc, etc, etc. So, um, I'm, I'm very sorry for anybody who noticed I didn't post any videos this week. If Well, my fans are like this little tiny bit, but um, I know there's some people who were like, probably, probably were like, what's going on? Why didn't you post a video? Um, I had technical difficulties um, with uh, my promo look at video. Um, I was trying to make it and things didn't go according to plan. Uh, they went a different direction. I was trying to make the video, get the information, but it just didn't work out because uh, I kept getting called on to, to do something else. And it's just been a very busy month for me. Um, so that's why Promo Look, I didn't get a video this week as well. And then with Curl Dislikes, I actually had the video. I had everything done and set for it. And for some odd reason, I don't know what happened, but when I was transferring the file to my computer, the file became an MP3 player with nothing in it. So I don't know what happened in that aspect, but it, it got deleted, basically. Um, and normally when I upload my, my stuff into my computer, I just uh, remove it from from my phone. So I don't, ha I can, I have more, I continue to have that more space, but I guess I shouldn't have done that until I get verified with the computer that it really did transfer. But I don't, I don't know. I, again, I don't know what happened. So that's what happened with Crow Dislikes, and I just got mad and I was like, screw this, I'm not gonna make another video. So um, I'm, I'm very sorry that things like this happen. I might just take one more week off just to catch up and do a little bit more research with items and stuff like that because, again, I've been very, very busy. I mean, August was another busy month for me. I had Monster Mania, I had a baby shower to attend to where I was the co host, and uh, it. it it just became so tough because I was, we were, and it was like five of us. We were like five hosts, well, no, four hosts, and like the main, the, the co, and the main host. And it was just, yeah, five. And it was just tough. Um, I remember the main host and me did not communicate well until like two hours into the baby shower um, because it, that's how much things we were just trying to set up like this and then organize it. It was just chaos. And in you know, certain ways it was chaos, but it was a memorable experience. A lot of people did have fun. So that's good. <laughs> but um, Monster Mania, my least favorite convention. I really made a pro dislikes about that. So you guys can check that out one out. And um, I'm happy I met Robert England. That was pretty much it. Um, I have two more conventions for this month. So it's going to be another little busy month for me. And especially... Uh, with a couple of other things I have to do, so it's it, it, it's still tough for me. And when Monster uh, Monster Mania and my next convention is actually next week, and that's uh, Heroes and Villains. And uh, I'm like, eh, how about it? The only reason I'm going is because one of my favorite shows, my top five favorite shows, um, one of my top five is Band of Brothers, and the guy I'm meeting is Eric. Avocado, avocado. I don't, I don't, I don't know how to say his last name. So I'm sorry if I mispronounce it. And it's that guy right there. So I already met Neil McDonald, and I met Abraham. Where's Abraham from Walking Dead? Well, he's on this picture, but I met him too. So um, I got to meet two of the band of brothers already, and I'm hoping to meet the other, the other band of brothers because it, it's a great show for me personally. If you guys like World War II movies, you really like that show. Uh, my favorite episode is the medic episode, and then comes the one with Abraham from Walking Dead. Uh, Michael, uh, I forgot his last name. <laughs> no, it's Michael something. Um, the one where he gets stuck behind enemy lines. Oh my goodness, two great episodes, by far the best I've seen when it comes to that show. Uh, and war type of um, shows and movies. <laughs> I should just say in general. Uh, but yeah. Um, but that that's about it. Um, I'm not too excited about it. I'll probably meet like three more people because I don't really watch any of those shows. I really don't care for the, for that convention as much. The other one I am looking forward to going to is the one in Atlantic City uh, for New Jersey Horror Con. And I'm trying to go, but I recently found out about it and I can't pre-purchase tickets uh, right now. So it's just like, eh, okay, fine. 
um i'll just pay at the door but um that's another one i'm just like a little ex um, i'm excited to go to i hope i can go to it i know it's like a two hour drive from here but um we'll see uh, that's all i can say for that one we shall see for that one um hopefully i will go for that one but we shall see um other than that um let me give you guys using updates on board games um as for the board games as far as i know if you guys pre-ordered um not pre-ordered um helped with the kickstarter for the dice tower man versus meeple the game boy geek and the secret cabal you guys should be getting your promos within october late um november maybe or latest december so i know the game boy geek was almost going to be sending them out which was in september I mean, uh, between August and September, so I was like, yeah, but th they had a little issue with uh, some of the promos or something like that, so they had to contact them about that, but it was, we were this close to getting the Game Boy Geek promos um, to anybody who Kickstarter them, uh, help support the Kickstarter, so it's pretty cool that they're, they're um, we're almost there, so one more month and it, we should be getting our hands on it, hopefully things go smoothly, because I know they say we, sometimes we have like little technical difficulties here and there, but those four, if you guys pre-order, um, pre help with the support of the Kickstarter, you, you guys should see something. And lastly will be uh, my board games. Um, I, I I can't say much about uh, seven, seven Continent besides I have to wait until next year. And hopefully Omega Saga, I get my hands on it on uh, October or November. Who knows when they're really, but they're saying they're still up to, uh, to schedule to release for October. So, hooray. Um, and I'm looking to get a new board game. Um, and hopefully i can get it this week but we'll see because my bills are normally um my bills my money is mostly going to bills and, and like knocking things out and and getting games right now is like a no-no for me but um i might be able to get grim forest this week and that'll be another game that i'm excited for and i did get a bunch of plastics i already you i already actually used uh this is 250 right here and I already used like almost 250 plastics that I bought because I bought four of these doubles and to see some of my cards from some of my games and uh, Stuff Fables is fully seal, seal, um, sealed, um, sleeved. Uh, I was sleeving a lot of my Dead of Winter cards, 80% uh, done. I just need the crossover cards, but I don't know if I'm gonna sleeve the crossover cards because normally it um, you can't fit everything in there and that goes for the expansion too but the expansion i just keep it in, in a different box the crossword cards but yeah we'll just see for that one and lastly would be uh my defenders of the last defenders of the last uh defenders of the realm not the last stand i, I don't even know that game defenders of the realm oh uh, that's the other one i'm missing too like um sleeve but i just need to sleeve the uh the expansion uh darkness spreads cards but everything else is sleeve for that one so i was actually working on it but uh <laughs> Again, I got caught up to do something else, so I was just like, oh, well, let me put this away then. So, that's that. And what else is new, for those who notice, I got my Freddy uh, little figurine down there. Um, you guys can't see them, but my Wishmaster, my Jason figures are up too. Um, I finally took them out of the closet, let's just say. And I moved uh, my Assassin's Creed origin statue here. I think it's by Iki? I don't know if that's the bird's name or him. I moved him here because he was actually aggravating me over there because I kept hitting him and then he kept shooting the bow and arrow. I'm like, oh, and I had to put it back together. And it's never easy to put this piece right here together because it's just like a mess. So Scorpion's now over there and he doesn't disturb me because that's he was next to the light switch and it was just disturbing me. So yeah, hopefully now it doesn't disturb me and Scorpion doesn't disturb me. So I want to keep him away from me <laughs> so that I don't touch him unless I have to clean this section up. But that's about it. So, yeah, hey guys, um, that's pretty much all I got. Um, I don't really have much to say. I'm still kind of busy. I'm hopefully I return this week. I mean, next week. I'm gonna say I'm gonna probably return with promo look at, or if not, I return with uh, Crow Dislikes since I already did everything for Crow Dislikes every, uh, more than I did the promo look at videos. Um, well, the next video because the next one was kind of be gonna be Yu-Gi-Oh, but I noticed Yu-Gi-Oh is not that good when it comes to information on a certain individual card, like to find out. How did this card come out? Whatever. So it's much easier for me to gather information for Pokemon than it is for Yu-Gi-Oh. Yu-Gi-Oh was just like a mess of just me looking around 
different sides. So we'll see if I continue, if I do at least one Yu-Gi-Oh one and then just say I'm done. <laughs> but we'll see from there. Um, but other than that, I got a special thanks for you guys for watching. If you guys want to comment, um, leave a comment below and say, hey, Crow, uh, and ask me some questions. I'll probably do it in an FAQ video later on, which I don't think anybody's going to really do with me, but we'll see. Um, but yeah, guys, I'll see you guys next time.